The nun's headgear, known as a veil or bonnet, but more commonly as a wimple, has a rich history filled with cultural, religious, and social significance rooted in various traditions and beliefs. Exploring the complexity of this garment involves a journey through centuries of history, religious traditions, and social changes. The origin of nuns' headdresses can be traced to the practices of religious women of antiquity, who often covered their hair as a sign of modesty and devotion. However, the systematic use of headdresses as an integral part of the religious habit of nuns developed mainly in the context of the Catholic Church during the Middle Ages. Over the centuries, nuns' headdresses have taken on a variety of shapes and styles, reflecting the different monastic traditions and cultural norms of the time. For example, Benedictine nuns wore the black veil while Dominican nuns wore a white headdress called a hood. These differences in religious dress reflected distinctions between monastic orders and their specific rules. In addition to their religious significance, nuns' headdresses have also had a significant impact on society and the perception of religious women. Throughout history, headdresses have been used as a symbol of spiritual authority and consecration to religious life. However, during the period of the Protestant Reformation and in some contemporary contexts, nuns' headdresses have been the subject of criticism and debate, sometimes seen as symbols of oppression or archaic restrictions on women's freedom. Despite the controversy, nun headdresses continue to be worn by many religious communities around the world as an integral part of their spiritual identity and practice. For some nuns, the headdress represents a tangible sign of their commitment to God and to the religious community to which they belong, so much so that they kiss it and pray before wearing it. Furthermore, the headdress can also serve as a means of expressing modesty and renunciation of the material world. In addition to their religious significance, nuns' headdresses have become an object of aesthetic and cultural interest. The iconic image of a nun with her headdress has been depicted in works of art, literature, and popular media, helping to shape the collective imagination of this religious garment. The wimple is often worn along with other accessories, such as a headband or chaplet, which can be used to keep the headdress in place or to add a touch of elegance to the nun's overall look. These accessories can be made of different materials, such as fabric, metal, or beads, and can be customized based on the nun's individual preferences or the specific traditions of her religious order. In contemporary culture, nun headdresses continue to inspire fashion and design, with some modern reinterpretations combining traditional elements with contemporary influences. These new interpretations can be seen as a tribute to the enduring influence and relevance of nuns' headdresses in culture and society. In some congregations, nuns may shave their hair as part of their vow of chastity and total dedication to God. This practice symbolizes a complete abnegation of the world and a renunciation of earthly pleasures, including personal appearance. However, not all nuns follow this practice, and many simply prefer to keep their hair tied back and covered by the cap. It is important to underline that decisions regarding hair shaving are often based on the specific traditions and rules of the congregation to which the nun belongs and can also be influenced by cultural and personal factors. So while some nuns may choose to shave their hair as part of their religious commitment, others may opt for alternatives such as cutting their hair short or keeping it long and hidden under the head covering. The nun's wimple therefore represents much more than a simple piece of cloth. It is a symbol loaded with religious, historical, and cultural meaning, which has stood the test of time and continues to influence our understanding of the spiritual world and social dynamics. Even the rest of the nun's clothing is a distinctive element of their religious identity and their commitment to a consecrated life. 
The main component of this clothing is the cassock, a long garment that is often associated with monastic life and religious service. The cassock, also called religious dress or monastic dress, has ancient roots that date back to the first centuries of Christianity. Originally, the cassock was not only a symbol of consecration, but also a practical garment worn by ascetics and desert monks as protection against the elements and harsh environments in which they lived. Over time, the cassock became an essential element of the nuns' clothing, symbolizing their separation from the secular world and their commitment to a life of prayer, service, and humility. The monastic habit is often made of plain, dark-colored fabric, reflecting the humility and sobriety that characterize religious life. In addition to the cassock, nuns often wear an apron or cloak, which can vary depending on the religious order and specific traditions. This additional garment can serve practical purposes, such as protecting the skirt during daily activities, or have symbolic meaning as a sign of modesty and service. The nun's habit is often complemented by accessories such as a belt or a cross, which can have deep spiritual meanings. The belt, for example, can symbolize the bond of love and obedience that nuns have with God and their religious community, while the cross represents the sacrifice of Jesus Christ and the redemptive love that guides their consecrated life. It is important to note that nuns' clothing can vary greatly depending on the religious order and cultural traditions. Some religious orders may opt for simpler, more modest clothing, while others may incorporate distinctive elements or decorative details into their attire. However, despite these external differences, all nuns' habits share a common commitment to religious life and the spiritual values they represent. The nuns' clothing, including the cassock, is a tangible symbol of their commitment to God and the religious community to which they belong. Through its simplicity, humility, and spiritual significance, the nuns' habit continues to inspire respect and admiration for their dedication to religious life and service to others. We invite you to like the video if you appreciated this content. We also kindly ask you to subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell so you don't miss our next content. Thank you so much. See you soon.